Today, welcome to Life with Belsif. I'm your host, Belsif. Today on the Belsif Show, we got to put new taillights on this trailer because these are just cocked over and every time I use a trailer, it just... They don't work. We got a couple new lights given to us and by the looks of it, they're just as cocked over because look at the size of the wires. What's really going on? Oh well, hey. So we'll get this one off and see if we can't figure out this one. The first thing we're going to need is the socket. Oh, look at that. First guess, Jim. Well, today's the first day of a couple days off. Time to get some stuff done around here. Oh, that come off. Nice. Well, there we go. That one's off. So all I need is... Careful. Figure out what the hell's really going on. Why does that one have three wires? This one has two wires. Jim? Who knows? Captain. Let's take off the lens and find out. Can you see? Probably not. Take off the lens and find out, Will. So, the trailer is the ground. We're gonna write the trailers aground. Why well, wouldn't it be the ground? Didn't look like much of a ground to me. Captain. So we'll cut these off, like so, and uh, we'll uh, put that over there. Splice these off. I do have a splicer tool. Here we go, time to bring out a hundred goddamn tools for one job. Splice, splice. So on the other side it looks like orange red. So I'm thinking, the white goes to orange and the yellow goes to green. Fine, old Bubba. Let's get this thing apart and have a gander at her. Never did like f***ing taillights. Oh. Didn't even come with a friggin'. So one's a marker light. Black's a marker light. White's probably ground. This is just gonna cock me right over. So, I guess the trailer's still the ground somehow. Who wired this thing up? We gotta make sure we have a good ground we do. So now that we have that done, we just need to put a washer on here. Actually, what we should do is run these wires in to the light, because they're so small and dinky, and we'll run the good wires into here. Friggin' right. Let's get them inside the housing. Decent. So we'll put a washer on here, and we'll put a washer on here. We'll slide this on here like so. Another washer, a lock washer, and that. Wow. Another lock. So what I'm thinking here, and I'm just thinking, is that we gotta ground this. I gotta take it back off again. So the ground. What the fuck is orange for fuck's sakes? I'm fucking confused. Why? I don't know. Okay, so the trailer was ground. What do you do with my light? Leave it way the hell over there. Why wouldn't I? Been a while since I did this, so you're gonna have to bear with me here. All right, so I figured it out. How this works is the black is for the side marker light, and the yellow, or then the white is for the marker light in the back. And the yellow is a signal. So the yellow has to go to the green, and the two go to the orange, because that's the way she goes, Captain. Which makes sense. And hopefully I'm right. We're gonna find out. Why wouldn't we find out? We'll twist them two together, and we'll twist them two together, and we'll put a washer in here, like so. And we'll put these back through, and we'll put this back into the trailer like so. So, she's gonna be mint, she is. There we go. So now we'll put a washer, a lock, and a nut. Um, Decent. Washer, careful. Washer, lock, and a nut. Decent. There we go. So now we can tighten that up, and that's our ground. We're gonna test this all before we do the final solder, we will. So, this is gonna go to this, and this is gonna go to this. So we'll put our bulb in. So let's back the truck up and we'll see if it works. Oh, fucking not. Holy. <laughs> what do we got? Anything? Nothing. So the problem lies further up. Shit balls. Yeah, we have a bad ground, Captain. Frick. Oh! We got something. There we go. So now let's try the parking lights. So that's how she's got to go, just like that, Captain. Side marker. So there you go. So we figured it out. So orange is my marker light and green is my signal light. Yellow coming from the bulb is the signal. White coming from the bulb is a marker light. Black coming in from the side marker is a marker light. Ground to the trailer. Decent. So, we'll get this soldered up and uh, put together. And we'll tuck everything in here nicely because that way it stays nice and dry, Jim. 
Put her in a friggin' bulb sack. We'll twist this together like so, and we'll solder her up, which will be friggin' decent. There we go, there's one. Cool down for a minute. Slap these two together. Put a friggin' heat shrinkage on there. Solder the dicks out of it. Decent. There we go. So now we gotta tuck this in here, and tuck this one in here, and put the friggin' lid seat back on. And then we can say we did something today. Okay, sorry, is this killing me right now? What in the f there we go, there's one. Next. I'll tell you one thing, it really sounds like you uh, American boys over there and girls peoples are having a hell of a time with that Corona. Sounds like it's breaking out over there more than it was over here, that's for sure. God, stay inside, stay home, man. Quit kissing each other so much. I want you all to survive, I do. Terrible. Stay safe. Friggin' right, you better. How come I can't find the thing? There it is. Well, that's off. Cut and cut. Cut and gone. Might need this freaking light bulb out of that, eh? Please go in the clouds, son, because you're just killing me right now. They don't do sun very well. When I got home, there was cloudy days and the sun was in. It was beautiful. Now it's harder than freaking dicks. You know what I just noticed? There's no freaking duck. No wonder why I got these things given to me. There's no lens in the freaking bottom of it. Like, what the? <laughs> <laughs> Holy f Thanks a lot for nothing, eh? Why the hell wouldn't you? I knew it was too good to be true when it's free. Just get cocked over every time I do. Seeks. Oh, the other one's got one. This is not this one. That sounds real good, buddy. Why wouldn't you? All right, there we go. That's ready to go. Does anybody know what we forgot to do? A little grind action. One. Man, it feels good when that sun goes out, I'll tell you. Wow. All right, so. Twisty, twisty, soddy, soddy. That's all soldered up. Now we're just gonna slide the shrink wrap over. Give her a little heat of rooski. Goddamn heat shrink. I'm quick being a dick. Heat. Sun's enough to freaking melt it. There we go. So we'll shove this up here like this. And we'll shove this one up here like this. And we'll get the tail light out of the other one. These are the worst goddamn freaking lights ever. These ones aren't freaking better. Bingo. Found her, Captain. She's top of the line too, that one. Friggin' no it's not. Look at that. That's something else. I think he bought the cheapest lights you can find. Eugene. Here we got $100 lights. I'll buy the cheapest ones I can find for you to replace them. Thanks, why wouldn't you? All right, there we go. So let's try them out. We got parking lights. Decent. Friggin' right we did. I friggin' did that, I did. Well, there we go. I got taillights in the trailer again. So now we can bring decent wherever we want we can. And it's safe. Hopefully you like this little video of repairing the backup lights or the trailer lights because they're just dickered over I know it's a little bit of a cocked over video but hopefully understood it and know what's really going on because I don't really don't know what's going on but all I know is it freaking worked and they're done so hopefully you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe and like hit that notification bell bar button and hopefully everybody will stay safe from this coronas and have a good weekend like I'm going to and uh, maybe I'll take you along okay you never know I think I will take you along I always do very right I do but stay safe, love you all, until next time. You know what to do for now.